So hello guys, welcome to Kotlin tutorial blog. My name is Ishang Dua and today we will be learning how to make a switch case program in Kotlin language. So but before like coming on to how to make the program, we would be understanding what is a switch case. In the switch case, we like give a, you can say one value that is case. It switches, it checks for the case and codes uh, like prints the code or gives the code, runs the code that is present in that case. So let's start. We would be opening the IntelliJ Idea Studio and creating a new project, Kotlin JVM and say would be naming it as switch case demo just finishing it going to source file make a new cotton file and say name it as main so in main we would be taking a function main passing arguments and array c of the string type now we would be taking a val say weak number equals say initially we have given the value as 2 after that we have taken where week day equals when week number here we have started the brackets and now we would be giving the cases to it that is on one say we have given Monday we can copy this code okay now here for two we can say give it as tuesday three for wednesday four for thursday five for friday and similarly six comma seven say for weekend now after that we would be giving else say not a choice or you can change it to say wrong choice after the else we would be printing here print line come inside this give week day is start this backslash and say give dollar week day say just we can remove this and we can give dollar week day and just give and before that a slash and a slash here and just erase this. Yeah. 
now we would be running it go to run run and main dot kt yeah so the big day is tuesday uh, because we have given two uh, as Tuesday so now we can also say give value as six now we would be running in to see the output it says weekend now lastly we would be take say nine now here we can see the output that weekday is wrong choice because we have not given uh, 9 here we have taken only till 7 so this was about switch case and when statement also we have taken when statement here uh, the switch case has say taken all the sorry all the values that we, all the cases which we have given and when it comes uh, like when we give when expression is when it comes to improvements so there are different ways that is we can improvise an existing functionality in kotlin when does exactly the same the most prominent problem with the switch case is which every developer like you can say might have faced this problem is the use of break if the break command is not used the compiler executes all the cases but here it is not the manner that's why we take the when case when statement now this was till here only in next uh, stay tuned for the next videos and more content on kotlin thank you so thank you guys for watching this videos kindly like this video comment on the video so that we can get more useful comments uh, from your side and can improve ourselves and share the video to your friends and to the people who you think it will help and subscribe to the channel so that whenever we add a new video you are always there and thanks for watching